You're struggling with the second serve a bit, but yeah. what's what are you feeling? I feel like I'm almost scared to swing pretty. Yeah. And then when I slow it down, I'm just yeah. Do you feel like uh, are you missing it a lot? Is it too much power, not enough kick, or are you just scared of hitting it? Yeah, I think not enough kick on it. Yeah. And also, um, it's awesome. Okay. I'm seeing something on the not enough kick. I'll just keep going. I'll show you now. I think I know exactly what it is. Just give me two more. That was a nice one though. But I know that you can you can kick it more to the right though. Okay, give me one more. Okay, so here's what's happening. Just go one first serve. Your first serve you're happy with, eh? Okay, one first serve. Obviously, you've got a big bomb. First serve is huge. So now what's happening is your first serve technique and your second serve technique right now is too similar. Okay. okay, and then that's why. So what's happening is you're serving your second serve and then you're almost ending exactly the same. So think about it. If you're trying to kick this ball like that, although it's a decent serve, but it's, it's almost like a slice first serve. Okay, it's because you're going and then you're going this Body's way. Falling. Yes, so here's what I want you to try. Everything the same, try and stay sideways. Okay, so try and stay sideways for longer, like you're keeping your head that way. Um, try it first, but there's a way to do it. I just want to see it just by focusing on it first, if you get it. So keep the body side on. It's already better, eh? So I like, the, I like to call it the Federer thing, so you try and, okay, I'm not warmed up, but so you try and serve and you keep your head there. Oh. Know what I mean? Yeah. So serve, stay sideways, head stays there, then the kick. There's another way to do it though, but just do that again. Okay, yes I like it, but what's happening now is, your contact point's almost the same spot as your first serve. So just allow the ball to drop a little bit. And then now you, you hit up and over, keep your head still. You have to hit up. You hear that sound? It's a lot better. I always tell my players, think about a, a four-in topspin chain. After contact point, if you're not gonna go up, there's no brush. So right now, what you're doing is on your kick serve, you're hitting it, Straight down. It's impossible, eh? Okay. Same thing here. Off the contact point. Up. Racket needs to be higher than the ball. The only way you can do that is if you wait for the ball to drop, then up. If you can't take too high, there's no space to go up, right? Yeah. Okay. Back. Let it. Let it come down even more. If it. If it helps you to, to do a lower ball toss, try it. There we go. How's that? How's that? So my like my seconds of ball toss very low. Like there's no there's no problem for you to go very low right your hand and then yes. How's that? It's crazy, eh? So also think about this: if the ball toss is lower and the pressure, it's easier because the the, the the higher the ball toss, the more risky it is. Like it's more time, more time to think. Uh, that's why when the wind blows, you also go very low ball toss. If you want more serves in, just go lower, and it will also help you with your kick. It's feeling better, honestly. Okay. You can even go lower, hey? as crazy as it sounds. There we go. And now, I want you to hit the ball. Like when you look at the ball, here's the ball. Imagine yourself hitting the ball up and to the right. Nothing across. Get it to the guy's backhand. Okay, again. We're gonna do a quick intervention after this one. It's jumping though. It's jumping. Okay, can we have five servers like this quick champ? Okay. It's much better though, eh? Mm, much better. But now this is just a draw. Okay, I want you to serve. 
as high as you can and have the ball still drop in the blue. It's going to be hard to get in a service block, but do something like this. Still in the block or just in, just, the, blue? Just in the blue? So what's that going to teach you? Um, yeah, you have no choice but to hit up on the ball. Just get the feeling. So even higher. You know what I mean? Yes. It's too hard though. Okay. Feel it on your strings. Okay. Yes. Look how you're fixing your ball toss. I'm not saying anything. Keep quick, keep going. That's my boy. One more. It's a massive kick serve when you're trying to hit too high. Sure. See, that's the idea. Now I'll go back to normal kick serve. Um, I want you to toss the ball and catch it. Okay, let's go again. Okay. So now, just, just get ready, put your left arm up. Okay, that ball, that ball was passing somewhere here. Okay, I, I want it extreme. I want now, if that ball, has, if you had to leave it, it needs to fall in here. That's how close it must be to you, okay? Leave it again. Leave it one more time. No. Yeah, but that's much better though. It must feel like it's close to you because then you can work the ball. Close to you, yes. Now kick that thing. It's right there with you. Yes. Okay, and again. Here we go. Look, it's a very, very good second serve. It's miles, miles better. But I feel like it's a bit more. Okay, now last little tip. Can you just have the ball a little bit closer to you? In terms of like more over your head. So. Your ball toss is in front, which is not bad. I teach that. But for you, because you need a little bit more upward. Behind you. Not behind you, but like if you had to leave it, it had to fall on your head. Okay? It must feel a bit behind you. Yes, boy. How's that? Okay, so that's your toss. Lower. A little bit behind you. And you just go up and over. It's a massive kick. Can we have three on the other side, then I'm happy. See, now it's not a first serve trying to be a second serve. Now it's a kick serve. Slightly higher. Massive kick though. But remember, if it comes closer to you, you can work it more. Last two. Proud of your champ. Now get this one to the back end. Nice though. One more. Close to you where you can work it. I'm happy with that. That's good. Rather miss it there for now. So Luki, if I... Oh. <laughs> How many times have I called him Luke? Sorry my friend. Okay, Callum. So if you had to play a tournament tomorrow, you're still laughing at the Luke. Yes, I feel bad. Sorry man. Okay. Love you, boy. Callum, if you had to play a tournament tomorrow, here's what I would say, but I want to ask you first. What I would say is, because I want you to go win, right? You're still laughing. <laughs> if I want you to go win tomorrow, I would say ball toss, much lower on the second serve. And I would say uh, ball toss, not in front, just for now, a little bit behind you, because that's the only way you're going to be able to work it. Okay. So you were too high, yeah. and then it's impossible. To, to hit up and over, and you were two in front, so I can't kick from there, it's gonna be a slice serve. But I wanna ask you, with everything we spoke about, what worked for you? Like, what's um, helping you? Definitely the toss. Yeah? Most of all. Yeah. Just getting more in the zone. Yes. So I can do more of it. Mm. It feels like I'm stretching how I was. Yes. I'm always turning into a slice. 100%. Yeah.
I try and get over it, it just goes bottom of the net. Yeah, yeah. So now, with it being closer, and even get more angle, control it more in place. It yes. Much more. This feels like you can rip it, because I mean, if it's right here, then you can work that thing, right? But your first serve, don't touch that thing. Your first serve is huge. Um, under pressure, remember, the closer and the lower to you, the better. So you're happy? Feeling better about it? Yeah, good. Also, uh, Callum is playing national soon, so we're getting ready for it. We're expecting big results. Good luck, boy. Thanks, Peter. Boom. Guys, thanks for watching. If you want to become part of my VIP team and become a master at this great game of tennis, click the link in the description. I'll see you inside.